please stand for the flag salute. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. November is Homeless Youth Awareness Month. November was first declared as National Homeless Youth Awareness Month in 2007. Since then, November has been a time to acknowledge those children and families ex experiencing homelessness. As many as 2.5 million youth per year experience homelessness. Along with losing their home, community, friends, and routines, as well as their sense of stability and safety. Many homeless youth are also victims of trauma. Youth are exposed to countless dangers with an increased likelihood of substance abuse, early parenthood. Impulsivity, depression, post-traumatic stress disorder, and a vulnerability to being trafficked. This year, our school will be supporting Haven, helping all victims in need by collecting essential items. During the week of November 13th or 17th, we are asking classes to collect as many items as possible. The class that collects the most will win a pizza party. On Friday, November 17th, cosmetology students will be around to collect all of your items. Please keep a record of how many items are donated per class period. This sheet will also be connected on November 17th. Thank you for your support. Please consider donating to Haven today. Good morning, Life Tech. Today is Thursday, November 9th, 2023. I'm Chris, and this is your student update. The coffee shop will open Tuesdays and Thursdays outside the library from 8 to 10.45 a.m. Drinks include hot and iced coffee, hot tea, sweet iced tea, and hot chocolate. Post-secondary representatives visiting Levy Tech during TAP are Teal College, November 13th, sign up in the guidance office. Attention students, there are many ways to compete in the Skills USA competition on Tuesday, November 21st. You can ask your top teacher for detail about your technical competitions, or you can sign up for the leadership competitions. Competitions for job skills demonstrations, action skills, CTE demonstration, job interview, prepared speech, and extemporaneous speech are available. See flyers outside Mr. Jasek's room for details. Today is the last day of trimester one. Make sure you turn in all of your assignments. Students will not have school tomorrow. Seniors, upload your senior yearbook photo on the school website. Check your Lampy email for more information. Scan the QR code posted around the school. Clubs will be on Tuesday now for LEIT's Law of the Week, Weather and Lunch Report. Have a great day, everybody. Welcome to LEIT's Law of the Week. This week's law is harassment. Did you know the person commits the crime of harassment when the person intentionally engages in any of the following actions to harass, annoy, or alarm another person? A person physically strikes, shoves, kicks another person, or threatens to do so, or follows the other person in or around public places, or repeatedly engages in actions against another person that have no legitimate purpose. These actions are a summary offense and can result in a fine up to $300 and or up to 90 days in jail. A person also commits the crime of harassment when a person uses lewd, levacious, threatening, or obscene language or materials when communicating to or about another person, or the person repeatedly communicates in an anonymous manner or repeatedly communicates at extremely inconvenient hours to another person. When a person communica communicates to or about another person, as I've mentioned, the person commits a misdemeanor offense which can result in a fine up to 1,000 in or up to one year in jail. Thank you for listening. Be safe. Know your laws. Thanks, me. For today's weather, it is rainy with a high of 63 and low of 42. Now, onto your lunch report. Thanks, me again. Today, in line one, are breaded pork chops, butter noodles, broccoli, rolls, fruit, and milk. And in line two is grilled chicken sandwiches. Have a great day. Now, I forgot what I meant to say. <laughs>